After injecting sedated brood stock with Ovaprim, transfer them to the spawning tank. Stock at least three males to each female in a spawning tank. The salinity of the spawning tank should initially be of low salinity, the same salinity as in the brood stock tanks. Monitor the recovery of sedated brood stock. Gill movement will increase as the fish come out of sedation. The spawning tank should be covered with netting to prevent the fish from jumping out. When all the fish in a spawning tank are fully recovered from sedation, drop the water level to about one quarter full. Next, connect seawater to the tank, then run seawater into the tank. The tank should approach full seawater salinity within 12 hours. Overflow tank water into a 300 micron mesh egg basket set into a tub. The spawning tank should be heated to 28 degrees Celsius. It should also be well aerated to keep eggs in the water column. On average, spawning occurs about 56 hours after hormone induction. From around 48 hours post-induction, check egg baskets at regular intervals for a spawn. Eggs are easy to spot with a torch. Concentrate spawned eggs by partially lifting the egg basket out of the water. Scoop eggs out of the basket with a beaker or a similar container for transfer into a bucket and then to an incubation tank. Fill the bucket to a known volume for a later calculation of the number of eggs in the bucket and for calculation of fertilization rates. Counting of eggs is described in the egg incubation tank management video. 